Well, for the past 52 years, artists of all kind have traveled from far and wide to participate in Bemidji's Art in the Park show. Reporter Cheryl Moore tells us what it is that keeps them coming back for this week's Community Spotlight. Art in the Park weekend in Bemidji will usually see around 2,000 people. In a warm day in July, many of those people will tell you that there's nothing better. It is one of our best fundraisers. We actually rent booth spaces and try to bring a variety of different kinds of artists to the community for a weekend every year. A wide variety is an understatement in this case. This year, there are more than 100 booths on the grass at Library Park. The show continues to grow and has become sort of a not-so-well-kept secret in the art community. I um, live over in North Dakota. Uh, typically, I'm in a different part of the country doing shows this year. Um, I heard about this one, so I thought I'd give it a try. Some attendees would say it's the best place to get some creative inspiration. From booth to booth, you have a chance to speak to the artist in person and ask about their process. Um, what do they uh, do during the year to make to create their craft or their art. Those who took the time to stroll through the park this weekend were able to meet hundreds of vendors. They were selling everything from photography to clothing to jewelry. One of the cool things about art in the park is that some of these artists have been coming here for decades, while for others this is their first time in the show. I started coming in 2010. A friend referred me to this show way back then and it's been my best show out of all of the shows that I do every year, which is about anywhere from 15 to 20. I think this is our year 11, and they do a phenomenal job here. Uh, it's, we call it our home show. We're from Bemidji, and we do anywhere from 10 to 20 art fairs a year. Art in the Park is a draw for the creative types, partly because of the energy the Bemidji community brings. It's a true destination for the arts here. We have the Bemidji Symphony Orchestra. We have live theater um, all year round. We have the city band. We have the sculpture walk. Uh, 365 days a year, 24-7, there's art happening in Bemidji. And of course, it's nice to see your regulars, who have over the years kind of become your friends. Uh, I have people that come back every year, and some come here just to see me and to get their jam supplies for the whole year. And Running in Bemidji with this week's Community Spotlight. Sheryl Moore, Lakeland News. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.